Anthrax, the deadly pathogen. Anthrax, a word that strikes fear into the hearts of many, has a storied history as one of the most notorious infectious diseases known to mankind. Its association with bioterrorism and its ability to affect both humans and animals have made it a subject of great concern. In this video, we will delve into the fascinating world of anthrax, exploring its origins, transmission, symptoms, and the measures taken to prevent its spread. Presently, the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development alerts the general public on the outbreak of anthrax in some neighboring countries within the West African subregion, specifically, northern Ghana bordering Burkina Faso and Togo. Anthrax is caused by the spore-forming bacterium known as Bacillus anthracis. These resilient spores can survive in harsh environments for long periods, making them a persistent threat. While anthrax is typically associated with herbivores like cattle and sheep, humans can also contract the disease through direct contact with infected animals or contaminated animal products. Symptoms Transmission and Effective Prevention Measures Although relatively rare, anthrax poses a significant threat to both humans and animals. The symptoms of anthrax can vary depending on the route of exposure, which includes cutaneous, inhalation, and gastrointestinal. The three main types of anthrax infection are 1. Cutaneous anthrax. This is the most common form of anthrax infection and occurs when the bacterium enters through a cut or abrasion on the skin. Symptoms typically appear within 1 to 7 days after exposure and include a small, painless sore that develops into a blister with a black center. Swelling, itching, and a mild fever may accompany the sore. 2. Inhalation anthrax. Inhalation anthrax occurs when spores are inhaled into the lungs. Initial symptoms may resemble a common cold and include fever, fatigue, mild chest discomfort, and a cough. As the infection progresses, severe breathing difficulties, shock, and meningitis-like symptoms may develop. 3. Gastrointestinal anthrax. This form of anthrax occurs when contaminated meat is consumed. Symptoms may include abdominal pain, vomiting, bloody diarrhea, and fever. Gastrointestinal anthrax is rare but can be fatal if left untreated. Prevention measures. Preventing anthrax requires a combination of personal hygiene practices, public health measures, and specific precautions for individuals working in high-risk occupations. Here are some essential preventive measures. 1. Vaccination. Anthrax vaccination is available for individuals at high risk of exposure, such as laboratory workers, veterinarians, and military personnel. Consult a healthcare professional to determine if vaccination is recommended in your case. 2. Animal safety. Avoid handling sick or dead animals without proper protection, especially in areas known for anthrax outbreaks. Regularly vaccinate livestock, particularly sheep and cattle, to minimize the risk of transmission to humans. 3. Safe meat handling. Purchase meat from reliable sources and ensure it is properly cooked before consumption. Thorough cooking kills the anthrax bacteria, rendering the meat safe to eat. Thus, to stay safe, you need to ensure thorough cooking of bush meat, animal skin popularly known as ponmo in Nigeria, until the outbreak is over. 4. Protective clothing. Individuals working in high risk occupations, such as veterinarians or laboratory personnel, should use appropriate protective clothing, including gloves, masks, and goggles when handling potentially infected animals or specimens. 5. Enhanced hygiene practices. Practicing good hygiene is crucial in preventing anthrax. Wash your hands thoroughly with soap and water after handling animals, animal products, or soil suspected of contamination. Avoid touching your face, mouth, or eyes before washing your hands. 6. Public health surveillance. Government authorities should maintain strong surveillance systems to detect anthrax outbreaks promptly. Timely reporting and effective containment measures are essential to prevent the spread of the disease. History and Bioterrorism Concerns Anthrax has been present throughout history, with recorded outbreaks dating back centuries. Notably, the Anthrax Letters incident in 2001 raised global awareness of the disease's potential as a bioweapon. The deliberate dissemination of anthrax spores through the postal system in the United States caused panic and led to several fatalities. Diagnosis and Treatment Timely diagnosis of anthrax is crucial for successful treatment. Healthcare professionals typically use laboratory tests to confirm the presence of Bacillus anthracis. Antibiotics, such as ciprofloxacin and doxycycline, are effective in treating anthrax, especially when administered oral. Conclusion Anthrax continues to captivate scientists and the public due to its potential for both natural outbreaks and deliberate misuse as a bioweapon. While advancements in medicine and increased awareness have improved our ability to detect, treat, and prevent the disease, it remains a persistent global concern. Continued research, surveillance, and collaboration among experts are essential in safeguarding public health and mitigating the threats posed by this ancient scourge. Please subscribe to our channel so that you can be notified when we release the next video on the next disease outbreak. Note that, knowledge is advancing by the day and we will like to always post an update on new advances on how to stay healthy. You can contact us via the link in the description below for any medical inquiry. You are watching Zoom Hospital channel and listening to work of Dr. Criordi.